works. There we go. I'm here. Hi. Well, let me refresh. <laughs> and I see you. <laughs> I guess I, you don't need to stream on Twitch anymore. Discord. Anymore. I probably do not. I could probably turn that off. Yeah, because I can see you. Ooh. Hi. What? It's my 22 month anniversary. Nice. Yeah, it's been it's been a while, huh? Or are you talking about something else? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I am not talking about anything else. <laughs> nope, it's been twenty two months since I fought, since I subscribed. Nice. And I appreciate you every single month. <laughs> Oh, it's all good. Where you know, you don't have my... to. You know, I don't. Where you... else would I spend my Saturday? I have fun when I hang out with you. Well, I'm just a down to earth kind of guy. That does you know, doesn't like a lot of stupid stuff. Fair, fair. And it, it, it happens. I mean. Yeah. Well, and like for me, I don't like. I know everybody really likes drama and chaos and things of that nature, but I find that they do. I find that it makes me cringe. You know, it's it's not yeah, something it, that I it's not something that I enjoy on a regular basis. Well, yeah, I, I'm not a big fan of drama. My ex-wife used to love drama. Yeah. But yeah. I try to pass. This is true. And I just yeah, I I'm I've never been I've never been a big fan of the drama. Maybe it's because my mother was always full of drama. <laughs> it's just like, okay, I right? don't want I don't wanna be like that. <laughs> so now she'll be all over the high school. Janitor's got to make his money somehow. Yeah, somehow. Okay. Let me get my cursor back over here. All right. So, you know, one of these days, I'll get back into that game. Which game? The one I'm that playing game. right now? Yep. But it's like, I got the expansion for, or the, the DLC for. Starfield. Uh huh. I haven't even touched that yet. Uh, well, you have a tendency to like playing Sims a lot more than any other game I've noticed. Right. I, I mean, I'll play that. another game for like two, three hundred hours. Uh huh. And then I bounce back to The Sims. And yeah. When I get Ooh. bored of The Sims, and I'll bounce to another game for two, three hundred hours, and I'll come back to The Sims. Fair enough. Okay, she is at the same level as her. All right, so she now she can go home. I think it's this one. Is it this one? She's got no worst headache imaginable. Oh, yeah, those are always fun. Well, from changing into a werewolf. Ah. Yeah, I've been. That's something else I've been dealing with is the the whole. I've been getting a lot of sinus headaches recently. And it's probably because the weather is changing a lot. Right, right. It's not okay, fun. So now they both need to level up and defeat Greg in a werewolf brawl. I'm going to go use is the restroom. That, okay. <laughs> Uh, is that what? Is that why you keep leveling them up? Is because it's they have to beat him in a brawl? Yes. Okay. And then they're also going to need to work out. So I'm going to have to send them to a gym. So they can get muscular. Oh, there you go. Now, the other girl that I did, the little uh, 
the little curly haired girl. Uh huh. She was running around. Uh, she had that trait or that this uh, aspiration. Uh huh. And she was went to uh, Moonwood Mills and ran into Greg and kicked his butt first time. Nice. It's like yes. That's how you <laughs> do it. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay. See. I think that's the right height. I think I left my windows somewhere else. No. Did I leave my windows somewhere else? Backpack. <sighs> I did. Okay. We're going to do this, though. We're going to put some light in here. Put in some little lights over here. I'm not generally a big fan of the whole sandstone thing, but I've been watching a lot of refurbs lately on YouTube, and I was just like, I really want to see if I can pull this off using the same types of materials that the original build was built with, if that makes sense. And so far we're not doing too bad what i really want to know how to do is the stuff like that i don't know what what is done or what they use to create those little insignias and stuff on the walls or if there is a way to create these like little shutters those are really cute i know i've seen people use them maybe it's like a when the whole game comes out sort of deal but I've seen I, I've watched the little tips and tricks on YouTube on how to create things like that but this I don't know I think it hmm. yeah. I don't know how it's done unless it's like something oh. that like the blacksmith has done and I definitely do not have that stoned fencing yet. We'll get there. We'll get there. I'm gonna make this a little I'm gonna make this a little courtyard I think. Well, what are they We're gonna go through and then over there I'm gonna put in a little wall. I'm gonna go over here. Let's see. Run 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 I'm gonna come over here and because I have basically the whole island covered I'm going to put in a little doorway here. Uh, all right, I'm back. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to put in yeah, a... My... Your roommate's up. Uh, um, yeah, he's up. Uh, let's see. Let hit refresh. So, yeah, so I'm going to... Why are you still streaming on... Uh... Oh, sorry. I forgot. <laughs> we started talking and I completely forgot. Well, I'm just wondering. I'm just wondering. Here, let me oh, let me take yeah, care he, of uh, that. Stop streaming. <laughs> he has to. Uh, okay. He's going down to the uh, VA ah, to okay. get his uh, free COVID shot. Oh. And I was telling him, yeah, I should. I actually sign up for that shit one of these days. Have you Have you ever gotten your shot? No, no. Sign up for the VA. Oh, oh, that's right. Because uh, I am a vet. Those, are, well, they're they're. It's for like the retired military, yes. Or is well, it? Well, it's for it's for any veteran. Okay. You you don't have to be retired to. Uh, do it. Oh. I didn't so know I that. To, I thought you had to be I retired just, before you could do that. No, no. As long as you've served the military you can sign up for the VA okay I just so it doesn't matter how long you it. were in there it doesn't matter how long you were in there you can still well you have to be in there at least uh, four years I think okay yeah I think that's or, standard isn't or, it yeah and have or three years and have an honorable so well, there you go. Because when I initially signed up, I for a three by six, which is three years active duty, two years active reserve, and then inactive reserve. Oh, okay. 
Yeah, yeah I, I grew I, I grew up a military brat. But what I did while I was on my uh, active duty or my active reserve, I just got so fed up with the one weekend, two weeks out of the year bullshit. Uh huh. Duty. Well, I know. Okay, so my I see my biological father. He was a lifer. If that makes right, sense. Right. Yeah, he right. was a lifer. He was in there until he was in there for like 20, 20 some odd years. I know it was we'll past twenty years. Had I thought <clears throat> about it, I would have stayed out. Okay. But I was a little upset with them. Okay. Uh, well, it my, happens. Uh, it happens. Well, when my mom passed away, I tried to get stationed close to home. Okay. And they said no. Oh. So I said, well, fuck I can, you then. I'm well, getting, I, I can I'm see how that would here. make you mad. Yeah. So when I got out, I actually didn't go home. I moved to Texas. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. So, yeah. Well, I'd your probably... mom had already passed away by that point, though. Yeah. Yeah, so and you didn't like, really well, need to, you didn't need to go back then. Well, true. But I was, I was going to help my dad with my little brothers okay which you know didn't happen but at least not at that time right but i did eventually make it back there because texas sucked Fair. well i mean let's see it, when i lived in in texas it was mainly i don't have a door here yeah, Texas was uh, <clears throat> hot, muggy. Yeah. Well, we also lived... The market was sucked. Well, when we first moved there, Max got a job offer in San Antonio. So that was our first spot in San Antonio. Or was... Ah. not Sorry, El Paso. That was the, He got the job offer in El Paso, which is... I've been through El Paso. All desert. All desert. And then into yep. San Antonio, well, we moved there. I when drove he's... through El Paso. <laughs> well, then we moved into say. San Antonio because he started doing his um, overseas work. And right, right. it was just me and a handful of kids. And I was just like, I didn't want to live in El Paso by myself. Right. You know, so we, I drove like, was like, what, 10 hours and went into uh, San Antonio because my mother-in-law and my brother-in-law were both there. So, because they had that moved, they moved there when, uh -huh. um, shortly after we had see, moved to El Paso. See, look there, something strange going on down there. For some reason, Ben is having a pain while peeing lately. Oh, boy. Not to mention that odd stuff coming out of Jesus. You. Hopefully it's just a weird <laughs> thing that will go with. But what if it's not? So, shift. Go that is into, nasty. Yeah. Actually, no. so go into to our who health. See, and I don't know how to stop that unless I just uh, take that part out. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yep, I know what you mean. It's like... So, so Nina... But, yeah, even even up in Dallas, where my where my father, my, my as, as the kids say, bio dad lives. <laughs> um... It gets really hot up there, and then that whole stretch down through through there, the uh, Dallas Fort Worth, Austin, and down into San Antonio, is essentially Tornado Alley. And yeah, my uh, that sister, that's not fun. <laughs> my sister and her brother, mm. or her husband, okay, her brother, uh, my brother-in-law, they actually live in Dallas. Okay. 
there for a long time. They lived in Houston area mm-hmm. in a little town called Webster. Okay. Because he is, he is pure Texan. He was born <laughs> there. He's got five sisters mm-hmm. that live there. Right. And he doesn't like any of them. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> so, but yeah, so they live, they live. They lived up here for um, probably a good 10 years. Mm-hmm. They had bought a house. We were buying a house. Okay. It was freaking huge. Like four bedrooms, mm-hmm. uh, big ass kitchen, big ass everything. That way uh, they could have people stay over during the holiday. Fair enough. So when he lost his job, he stayed home, and my sister went to work because she worked for the uh, she worked for the city of Seattle uh-huh. uh, for the attorney general's office. Right. And she did uh, child law, protecting kids. Uh huh. And then when she lost, when she got let go, her job. Uh, they decided, you know, to sell the house and move back to Texas. Uh, so now, I believe she is teaching law in Texas. Oh. Well, I guess it's a good good work if you can get it, right? Yeah, and he's, well, it was, she was doing it during the uh, pandemic thing. Uh-huh. So, it's like. Yeah. She enjoyed it. So does he have a baby? So let's see if other girl. Yes. Ooh, got a baby to girl. Nice. So Jocelyn or sorry. Uh Phoenix had Jocelyn. Oh. No, the baby's a werewolf. So, because both parents are werewolves. There you go. Let's... Where did she... Come on, you... No, you were just here. I just saw you. And did she go downstairs? Oh, nope, there she is. Molly Prescott. Choices. Casual romance. Physical intimacy. Mess around in the shop. Yeah, I changed Molly's uh, woohoo interests because <laughs> she was only interested in girls, and now she's interested in everybody. Yes. Now I got to go find her romance relationship with her has faded. Oh. So, Whoops. Yeah. Now I got to go find her. Come on, girls. Oh. Oh, there we Body. go. Stop. Wicked sex. Uh, Ooh. Got a lot of stuff in this one. Unless. 